So yeah, let's just um, let her keep her stuff because she probably needs it more than we do. You'd know best, wouldn't you? I have to go. Again, thank you. Yeah, again, this is the second time I've rescued you, lady. So maybe, hopefully I don't have to see you again. Go be safe and live life with your family. Stay away from super mutants and their assault rifles. Well, actually, maybe you could use an assault rifle. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on uh, the Tale of Two Wastelands Overhaul with the Capital Punishment mod list. We are on our way back to Great Itch, uh, and I want to do a follow-up on that um, quest that we got from Grady. It was this uh, Grady's last recording uh, where he wants us to grab a key, grab a package, and then deliver it to someplace. And my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere. And you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Gertershade. Tell him Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet at Marigold Metro Station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. And hopefully they won't find you too. All right, so we're for, we're looking for a room with a spinning light. I already have the key, but it looks to me like those could be Talon Talon mercenaries, and if they are, I'd rather get the jump on them than have them get the jump on me, which they've done twice so far. So yeah, let's uh let's give these guys a little taste of their own medicine. Wow, he's a good shot. Okay, there must be a th third one, I think. Or something else aggroed us for a moment. All right, let's loot this one. Look at all that stuff. Nice. There is a third room, but he's shooting at somebody else. Got him. Okay, who was he shooting at? Or what was he shooting at? A rad roach? H and K cause. Look at that knife, goodness. Oh my goodness, look at the damage this thing does. 250 DPS. And it's a 20 gauge. That that's a shotgun? <laughs> Holy shit. 
Is it uh, a shotgun with a scope? Are you serious? Wow. Okay. With that kind of DPS, I, I would have to say it's an automatic too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I had to test fire to make sure. This thing's a beast. What? I don't know about the scope part of it, though. I, I mean, I guess if we had slugs, it would be worth using the scope. Oh, no. He was shooting at a blowfly. Oh, man. Okay. This was worth the price of admission. All right, there's a bunch of stuff over here. Let's go. Uh, let's heal ourselves up a bit here. We'll take one of those, one of those, and a couple of those. Looking to see if there's any mines on the ground. Nice. Okay. Easy lock. Ammo box. Even more shotgun rounds. Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah, we've got ourselves a beast of a shotgun. Even more than what we had before. Uh, and this one holds 10 rounds in the magazine. Whereas the other one I think was only 5 or 6. Oh no, this was 12. This one has a, a really fast rate of fire though. But, I mean, the DPS on this thing is just insane. 247 DPS, whereas this is only 91. This one's worth more money though, which is very interesting. Okay, cool. Anyway, uh, what we're doing over here, if I didn't already mention this, is we want to go... Oh, I guess I did mention it. Sorry. Uh, we do want to go finish up that uh, quest for Grady. So that is why we're here. And then we're going to continue on into DC, I think. I mean, I wasn't actually expecting to run into Talon again so soon and now we got all that armor from them so we might have to make a trip back but of course if I do that I'll I'll do it off camera rad scorpion all right let's just leave him alone so we can not waste AP ammo I don't think he'll follow us in here what okay hold on let's get this on Why are there ants still here? I thought they are they all got killed off. Unless the uh the good doctor hasn't uh, managed to, to stop the threat. Guess that's always a possibility, huh? Anyway, okay, we're looking for a room that has a rotate... Oh, shit. A rotating light. I wasn't expecting repops in here. Oh, shit, he's right there. Fortunately, he's a little one. We might have to go talk to the doctor and say, and say, what the hell, dude? You're supposed to be taking these things out. Ah, look at this. A rotating light. So we're, we're over on the other end near Falls Church. 
I think, well, obviously we went in this room because the door's open. But we never opened up the safe. Lock. Wait a minute. Oh, no, we got to find the key first. Right. Okay, what did he say about that again? I think he said something about it being in a fire hose place. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet in Marigold Metro Station. All right, so so that's the safe, but we need to find a closet, a maintenance closet with uh with a fire hose. So I guess I didn't get the key. Let's go talk to the doctor and see if we can figure out why the hell the ants are still here. He was supposed to take care of the situation. Yes, what did you need? Well, I will continue my research. There has to be a way. Until then, I will be staying in my shack next to the Wilkes' home should you ever wish to visit me. When are you going to go back there? I mean, you've been down here for a long time. Okay. Much to he doesn't have anything to say to us. I'll make it right. They'll see. You better. Next time I come back here, if there's still ants, I'm going to come down here and just take you out and kill your queen. Because you're not doing what you said you were going to do. Okay, anyway. We got to find this uh, closet with the fire hose. It's in a maintenance closet, he said. Oh, we lit them up. Seems to be immune to fire, though, because, you know, fire ant and all that. All right, guys, I think I found the fire hose box with Grady's key. Yep, there it is right there. Uh, we are in um, Marigold Station, as Grady told us. Uh, where, you know, where he told us we would find this. Uh, we got an ammo box here. And some 10 mil rounds. We'll take that and that. Guess that's everything we want. Maybe we'll take that too. I think that's got a fairly decent... Uh, VW. Is that considered ammo? Yeah, it's got a really good VW 20. All right, so this spot here, for those of you who are curious, um, you just kind of come up this way, and that's this is Marigold Station right here. So that's the upper area. Um... It's, it's the sign that goes to Falls Church, except for you go on the right-hand side to get to it. Okay, I'll meet you guys back at the safe. Okay, we are back here at the safe. Let's open it up. And... Wha what? Naughty Nightwear? Are you shitting me? It gives plus 10 to speech and plus 1 to luck, though. All right. That's weird. <laughs> Um, it's considered light armor. All right. Well, that's what was in the safe. So, oh shit! What? That's not a good idea. Are, are you Grady? Lug I'm only gonna ask you this one time. Give me the naughty night. <laughs> Seriously? Uh. Okay, here. No need for violence. How about you pay me for it? No way. It's mine. Come on. Come and get it from me if you think you can. I mean, if you really want the naughty nightwear. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now scram. Goodbye. Whatever. Fuck you. 
I want my Naughty Nightwear back. He had a double barreled shotgun right in my face, you guys, so I had to use a little... <laughs> to use some tactics there. Oh, man. That was kind of funny. Lug nut. What an asshole. Uh, alright, anyway. <laughs> I thought that was kind of funny. I... Uh, that's worth 73 caps, man. Thing is, is we're so we're gonna be so freaking heavy with all this talent armor too. Uh, all right, let's let's take a look at the map here. What we want to do is we want to get to Rivet City uh, because we have two quests there now, and then we can go north to the museum and then to the Washington Monument. The thing is, though, is to get to there from here with only, how much do I have? Two pounds of carry weight left. <laughs> it's not, it's not like to, likely to happen. I mean, we can always stash stuff, but the other option is I go back home and, you know, do the thing. If we went back home, we could repair that, um that uh, close assault weapon system, the cause shotgun that we got, and then use it. That would be a good reason to go back, because I got the, all those repair kits back at the base. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to do that. So here's here's what I'll do, you guys. Um, I will meet you... I'll meet you at this... I'll meet you at Wil uh, Wilhelm's Wharf. And then from there, we'll go down this way and then cross over the bridge. Because this is just going back through Great Itch, and we've already all seen that territory anyway. Okay, so that's what I'll do. All right, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys. Uh, we are at a Wilhelm Wharf. And uh, I think we're ready to start heading south. So let's do that. And I have not been further south than this point um, so far. Uh, other than, well, I guess we were at the Anchorage Memorial, which is a little further south. But that's also on the other side of the river. So let's continue on here. I did fully repair my uh, cause. And uh, so now it does 300, <coughs> excuse me, 312 DPS and is worth 300 coin. Uh, quite a significant upgrade from our other auto shotgun that we had. And everything else is in a pretty good condition. This I actually looted off of a, uh, a, waste, a dead wastelander uh, on the way back over here. So that's where that came from. And uh, yeah, so we're good to go. Uh, we're in really good shape here um yeah so let's do this okay so uh let's look at the map here we could go across that bridge but i think what we'll do is let's just stay on this side of the river for now and th that way we can kind of explore some new territory as we go down this way uh okay i see something over there That doesn't look like a raider. Raiders don't usually sit down on park benches, do they? Or or wharfs. That looks like a traitor. All right. Let's put our weapon away so we don't appear threatening. What do you think you're doing? What do you need? Oh, you are a traitor. Okay. If the price is right, make me an offer. She has 135 caps. Lever action rifle that uses a 10 millimeter round. Huh. Interesting. She doesn't really have anything for us, and 
But I could sell her this H and K. I don't really need it. So why don't we do that? We'd get 42 caps if we sold it. Whatever. But um, if I put... Uh, does speech affect barter? I don't think so. I think it just affects options when you're talking to them. So let's put the trader um, outfit on. Take a look. Welcome to Godforsaken Hellhole. Not much to look at, but it's all mine. Okay, so you, <laughs> so, so you like stay in this area then? Is that what she she means? Maybe. Forty four. So we get two more caps. Okay, let's do it. Another satisfied customer. What is your repair skill? No just out of curiosity. As long as you're good for it. Thirteen. Okay. Nope. Whatever. All right, scavenger. It was nice to meet you. Stay safe, and maybe I'll come back and sell you more shit later. But you could use a few more caps, though. Let's head on. Keep on heading down this way. Probably shouldn't be right out in the open, because who knows what'll pop out. So we'll kind of stay closer to the buildings here. That's all completely blocked off. I'm assuming that's probably the Potomac River. I guess. I don't know. All right. Let's, um... Can we go up this way? Then we'll go around like this. is kind of not really a very good spot for me to be in because it'd be real easy to get stuck. But I didn't want to just walk straight up there because who knows. All right, so that's the main bridge. I don't see anything bad this way. All right, let's go see what's going on over best watch your back. here. What's going on? You know how it is. Okay, I'm not. Uh, oh, yeah, we do have enemy indicators. Are they underneath the bridge? Probably. There's two of them now. All right, so it doesn't look like we're going to be able to just waltz across the river on this bridge. That looks like a Brotherhood guy with a sentry bot. Unless there are other enemies that walk around in power armor. I think the Enclave has their own version of power armor, but you know, that could be them too. Now that I think about it. Because I don't think the Brotherhood has those kind of robots. Uh, I don't remember if the Enclave is hostile automatically or if they're neutral until you get on the bad side kind of thing. Alright, well, what we're going to have to do is come back this way. And see if we can hop down over through here. I mean, I'm not seeing anything else in this open area. Obvious. Anything obvious. We know we're going to have a couple of bad bads when we get back up that way. I am curious, though. If these guys over here are going to be hostile. If they are, then they're going to be dangerous as all get out. But I do have some armor piercing rounds. Let's go check over in this corner real quick. Oh, I can't even get through there. Invisible wall. All right, that's just a dead end. Uh, 
Oh, this is the Citadel. Okay, so those would be Brotherhood then. Interesting. So I expect them to be at least neutral. Yeah, Paladin Bale. Bale. Name's Paladin Bale. What do you need, civilian? What can you tell me about the Brotherhood of Steel? I can see you're trying to appeal to my good nature. Pity for you I don't have one. I'll give you this one for free. We use our big guns to kill big super mutants, so people like you can sleep at night. Okay, that's appreciated. Of course, I've killed my fair share of super mutants. How many have you killed? Uh, what is this place? You're standing in front of the Citadel. Headquarters to the Brotherhood of Steel. Capital Wasteland Detachment. Okay, um, can I come in? Negative. No super mutants, civilians, or traveling salesmen allowed. Hmm. Which are you? Um, anything about the super mutants I should know? Yeah, the city ruins are crawling with them. They've pretty much overrun all of old D.C. Do yourself and us a favor and stay as far away from there as humanly possible. Definitely no place for civilians. Um, okay. So, one thing that I'm thinking, and I don't remember this from my previous playthrough, is that when I put on Brotherhood armor, it says something to, you are now disguised or whatever as a Brotherhood of Steel. So I wonder if I have to dress up like one and pretend like I belong to them in order to get in with them. I don't know. Something Steel will be with you. Uh, something we can potentially investigate later. These guys are pretty damn dangerous. A nice day. <laughs> okay. If there's an issue, you should speak to my superior, Paladin Bill. Okay, he's got some popping with his sound file. Do not interfere with security operations. Gotcha. Okay, so interesting to know. Oh, do we have a trader down here? Oh, it's one of them travel bot thingies. That's a, a Brotherhood guy too, right? Yeah, pretty sure. Okay. Well, um... Are you sick of wanting through radiation? Are you sick of... According to this map, there isn't really another place, uh, a w another way across the river. It looks like it narrows down pretty good up here, though. So we could... So this whole thing's the Citadel, huh? Those are turrets. Hmm. I, I honestly don't remember the Citadel in my first playthrough. I do remember the Brotherhood of Steel and them, you know, patrolling the wasteland, but I, I don't remember this place. But here again, I don't remember everything either. Is that one of those mole holes? I mean, this is far enough away to where it might be worth it to have another fast travel location. Uh, uh, super mutants. It says either that or I could just throw a thousand caps at the, you know, the little robot guy that always says the weird stuff. Um, I don't think I'm going to try to attack those guys just because I want to save ammo. We could draw them over to the Citadel and let the Brotherhood take them out. I think all that stuff off in the far distance is just distant terrain and not actual places we can go. It's kind of neat that that's there, though, because then it just makes the place feel bigger. And whatever that smoking thing is, that's not one of the mole holes, because the mole hole smoke is green. Okay. Yeah, let's not mess with those super muties because we're probably going to have our fair share of killing super muties when we get to the other side anyway. So let's get back to this bridge. See if we can take out the two bad bads that are underneath it. And then we'll go from there. All right, what I'm going to do is I see one of them patrolling around. And it looks like 
that one is definitely wearing heavy armor, so we're going to want armor piercing rounds. But two of them showed up on my on my meter. Okay. So we have 38 AP rounds left. Oh, one other thing I was going to tell you guys too is I did confirm. Let's see if we can get a little closer. I did confirm that there is trajectory on this sniper rifle. Um, probably not horizontally speaking, because I don't think the game simulates wind, but definitely vertical. Okay, yeah, I do see two of them, and they're both wearing heavy armor. That one is just standing still. The other one's moving. All right, here we go. Well, those laser blasts have a lot of range, don't they? Let's just get down and wait for them to chillax. When you turn up, you're dead. Oh, he's closer than I thought. Get our AP rounds. Oh, he's going after the Brotherhood. What an idiot. Oh, he just killed the Brotherhood, though. Yeah, they took him out. Oh, he didn't kill that guy. He just knocked him down. Okay, good. Because I kind of feel bad about that, actually. Are you all right, Paladin Bale? <laughs> he seems to be fine. Uh, okay. Ooh, he's got a minigun. Crazy. This thing weighs 25 pounds. Um, and it uses five millimeter rounds, which I've actually been breaking down. It does 785 DPS in its currently really bad shape. If we fix this thing up, it would probably be an absolute beast. Do I have at least 10 strength? No, I only have seven strength. That's the other thing, too. Is that's going to affect our ability to... Uh, wield it but I would like to keep it because it's the first one we've come across so we we may have to do a, a stash situation here I don't think there are any other bad bads over here I only saw two that showed up but let's just kind of move in cautiously just in case Relax, fellas. Oh, Trouble's over. so much for that there is another one I could lob a grenade in there, but I'm not exactly sure where they would where they would land. Oh shit, there's someone right there. You're dead, meat sack. Alright, there's more than just a few here. Okay, let's get this ready. Did that guy bleed out or something? I don't think we immediately killed him. So yeah, these fucks are just waiting here for to ambush people trying to get across the bridge. That's what they're all about. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. There he is. He's over there. Nice. Soften him up. Oh my god. What did he do? Oh, I must, I must have set a car on fire or something.
Okay. I'm gonna say we are clear here. Definitely take any whiskey. Take Rad X for sure. A Watts 2000 laser rifle. Interesting. Okay. Uh, we'll, nah, I don't think I'll take either one of those things. We'll take those. That's an average safe. We'll eventually get our lock picking up to handle that stuff. Psycho. All right, so we have um, a heavy load here. We could go back to that vendor um, and offload some of it. I got two of these Watts 2000 laser rifles. Can I repair this with the other one? I can. All right, let's do that. All right, it's worth a little bit of money. Well, I think what we'll do is let's go back to that vendor on the dock over there and sell off as much as we can. And then I think I'll probably stash the rest at Wilhelm's Wharf. Uh, because she will she won't buy any of that stuff. She's just a food vendor. And then we'll just, you know, try and pick it up on the way back. I really would hate to lose the chain gun though. We might want to use that at some point if I can get my strength up a little more. Oh. We're currently we're actually still not encumbered. Hmm. Well, okay. Plan B then is sell whatever we can to her and then take the rest with us and see if we can just get to Rivet City where Evening. we can, you know, continue selling. Also, I forgot to put my armor back on. It's lucky we didn't get hit. What do you need? I have a few. All right, so she only has 91 caps. Damn. I'd kind of like to keep this because I think it's fairly unique. I don't. I have. I think I have a normal uh, laser rifle. <sighs> okay, so this metal armor is heavy as shit. Let's sell the two damage diversions and the raider stuff. Okay, we'll accept that. She has ten caps left. This is worth some bank. What if we buy her 10 mil rounds and her 5 mil rounds and her 20 gauge rounds? And what's that? Explosives? Yeah, we can buy. Sure, we can buy both of those. Those are useful to us. And then we'll just buy... I'll buy all of that stuff. Don't really need any of the rest of that. So let's just buy frag mines. Just enough to even the score here. One more. There we go. All right, super. So that gets us up to 1155 caps. And give me a shout if you need anything else. 
Whatever. And, uh, enlightens us up. A decent amount. Let's get this back on. And we'll just, uh, try and hang on to those weapons. Because here again, if I stash them somewhere, I run the risk of losing them. Oh, a cattle prod? A detonator. I think we picked that up in F Fort... Whatever that... F Fort Detrick. I'm not even sure what that's actually for. I mean, specifically what it's for. It's obviously for... Whoops. Sorry. Uh, detonating something. What do you need? Alright, let's sell this to you for six caps. Another set. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. So that should help us get closer to Rivet City. Uh, before we get massively encumbered again. <laughs> Story of our life, right? That's the way these games go. All right, let's cross over the bridge. What could possibly go wrong in doing this? Keep our eyes peeled for landmines. There's some potential ambush points. Uh, but there's also places where we can duck and cover. Firefight going on down there. I think when we come across these enclosures, I think those are super mutant camps. Maybe not in every case. Well, or raider camps. There's a raider there. Alright, they had a firefight with somebody and killed somebody. I think since that's not the direction we need to go and I'd like to get to Rivet City without or at least get close enough to Rivet City before we get massively encumbered, I think we're going to leave that camp alone. We may attack it later if it uh, makes sense for us to do so. Oh, that building just popped in there. Okay, let will just take a quick look here in our scope. Not seeing anything so far, but that doesn't mean there isn't anything there. Or something that will spawn in. Honestly, I'm kind of surprised that there was no resistance at all on this bridge other than the bandit camp at the other side. Okay, there's a muty right there in that skywalk. I don't think we're meant to get through that way, so we won't even try. Oh, there's one right there too. It's, it's very unlikely we're going to be able to get past those guys without them attacking us. So maybe what we should do is deal with them right now while we have a little cover right here. Alright, so... Uh, oh, no, let's stay prone. He's got a laser rifle. I don't know what the other one has. We want to prioritize the one that has the most dangerous weapon. So let's wait for that other one to pat back over here, and then we'll take a look and see what kind of weapon he has. Uh, I think he had some kind of an assault rifle attached to his back. So I'm going to say probably the laser rifle guy is the most dangerous. Yep, yeah, bring us that head. Okay, let's duck behind here and see if he'll 
forget that his partner just had his brains blown out. He did. All right. Well, nobody ever accused super mutants of being smart. Hmm. Does he have an immediate way to get off that skywalk to get to us? Let's just wait a few seconds longer before we do anything. What the hell's he doing? Alright, well, there's more than two. Either that or there's something else around here. Maybe? starting to get dark, so let's put these on. Alright, let's advance. Is there a way for me to get up on that ledge? There we go. Gives us a little more protection than just walking right down the street there. I don't even know how we would get up to that skywalk. It doesn't look like that's a, the kind of building you can go in. Unless maybe this one is. I don't know. There's even a higher skywalk up that way. Well, we probably won't be looting those guys then. Is what it is. Look on the bright side. We'll have more encumbrance to get closer to Rivet City. All right, we have an underground um, subway there. This is Irradiated Metro. Why do I get the feeling like there's probably glowing ones down there? I don't think we're going to go in there. Let's just stay outside. Theoretically, with our night vision, we should actually be able to move around in the dark a little more safely. Whether or not that actually is how things work, I don't know, because it's a video game. But one can assume that. Is that a behemoth or just another... I think that's just another super... Uh... He seems awfully big, though. I don't know. Let's avoid him. Wait a second. That looks like a Brotherhood armor. What in the hell is going on there? Well, that's not a Brotherhood. That's just a very well-armored super with some kind of Assault rifle with a drum magazine. And he's got a laser rifle. Alright, here again. I think let's avoid them. I'd really like to get to Rivet City. And, you know, once we do get to Rivet City, it probably would behoove us to just pay the caps for the fast travel. Not that I would use it all of the time, but it's not exactly a a quick and easy place to get to, you know. Is this a thing? It is not. All right, so we came down that way. Don't know if we can get through here or not. Let's take a look at the map. Oh man, we are still miles away from Rivet City. <sighs> I really don't want to go through that irradiated metro. Um. 
Let's just see if it's possible to get through here. No, I think I'm hitting an invisible wall. Maybe. See, I can't... I can't get th past this point. That's too bad. We almost made it over there. Alright, well, I guess we're not going that way. Shit. It might be that... If we want to go that way, we've got to go through that metro. So let's not. At least not right now, unless we get to a place where we have no other choice. And then that's where we need to be bringing a radiation suit or something anyway. Guess these are just places you can duck and cover. Is this a building we can go in? It is not. Okay, well that's where we were just looking. Am I seeing a person? No. It kind of looked like a person was kneeling down right there. All right, so there's some kind of a bridge there. But I want to keep kind of heading east and southeast as much as we can. Okay, let's see what happens when we poke our head up the top of here. We have phone booths and a vacuum, street vacuum thingy. Nuka Cola must not have an expiration date. Man, that's crazy to see all those buildings like that and all. At some point, I looked down one of the streets here, and there was one building that was completely leaned over on, at an angle on another building. Wasn't there some kind of movie called Cloverfield or something like that that had some kind of situation like that? Well, even that one's leaning quite a bit. That would be crazy to go up in something like that. Alright, I see smoke over there. And what maybe looks to be palisade walls or something. Alright. So whatever that camp is, it's probably not friendly. Whether it's Super Muties or Raiders. So let's proceed with caution. I'm not seeing any movements so far. Get back out of here. We bumped that car and it alerted the the mutant inside there. I think we have mutant. Yeah, we got one patent down there too. Okay. Try not to bump the car. Oh. There's another one of those Atlas statue thingies. Okay, don't move. I think he saw us, but he's not sure. Must have been nothing. Yeah, it was nothing. Move along, dude. 
absolutely nothing. Looks like they turned the... Uh, isn't that the Lincoln Memorial, maybe? Into some kind of water treatment plant or something. Let's go this way. That's the entrance to their camp. There's one over there too. Okay. Time to die. Shit. We are unstoppable! Alright, we are not in a good spot here. make our stand right here. Um, I'm gonna also... See if he comes this far. Going back the other way. Off with your cranium. It's going to get light soon. I'd kind of like to be past this point if possible. Assault rifle and a laser rifle. Let's see here. Yeah, it's got a decent VW. This one's less so. Can I... I can use that to repair this Watts. Okay, let's do that. So nice to be able to start, you know, being able to do this now. Uh... Can I... No, I can't repair the carbine with any of those. The mods on here do a pretty good job of making sure you're using similar enough weapons. Okay, so... We... Oh. Wait a second. Oh, no, we're good. I, I was reading that as 363. It's uh, only 263, so we're doing fine on weight for now. Just trying to see if... the t Okay, no, there's a guy way up there. All right, let's proceed. We got a dude over that way. Let's look at the map here. And yeah, we're getting close. And we do need to head that direction, so. Alright, he's quite a ways over that way. Let's just start moving this way. Man, he's got a prisoner captive. <clears throat> if we don't go rescue that prisoner, she's probably going to get eaten or worse. Or worse first and then eaten.
Okay, let's see if we can do that from or this side, though. Our character is too, too good of a guy to not tr Oh, there, that must be Rivet City there. To not try, you know. Okay. We've got a traitor and a centaur. Let's use our silenced pistol to take the centaur out. I don't know why they're not attacking it. That shit that they spit out hurts A and B, causes a radiation. Um, let's do a. Wait, that did, didn't give us a, a thingy, did it? What? No, it didn't. Okay. It was. It was like it was stuck on the radiation menu or something. Um, let's just pop, say, like three expired stim packs. That should be enough to get our health back up as high as it can go. Centaur blood. Uh, you're a little bit... Don't point that thing at me. <laughs> you're a little bit behind if you're supposed to be guarding your traitor. He's like miles ahead of you. I wonder if they'll get the attention of the guy up there or the guy down there. I'd actually like to go talk to that trader. And they're moving right to where that super was, so maybe they'll take him out. No, don't step in the water. How come that super's not attacking them? Oh, now he is. Nah, they just about got him. I'll help him. Glad that's over. It's not. We're still in danger. Um, we're being spit. Oh, centaur. All right. You know what? Let's take, let's take these off. It's too bright now. Well, I hope you know what you're that. doing. I'm helping you, dude, because you're a moron and you ran right into these enemies. Okay. What? Where the hell are you going? This guy just has the sledgehammer, right? Yeah, I'm not even... I mean... Let's go this way. See, I'm already encumbered. So, oh, it's Crow. Here to acquire a new mantle of metal or... He gets around, man. He's. I've seen him all the way up north of Megaton. Um, all right. Have a look. Four hundred. Anything calls out to you. Eighty caps. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, ah, damn it! I always forget to put my other clothes on, and then I'll forget to stay. To put my armor back on when we're done here. Looking to trade? Have a look. See if anything calls out to you. Oh, you don't buy weapons, dude. Ah, oh, that sucks. Um. Yeah, we don't have any armor to sell them. All right. Cryo later. What's your repair Maybe. skill? 78. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's top off our that and our helmet. 
We don't seem to be able to repair armor for some reason. At least not that I've noticed. That's expensive. These I don't really care about repairing. Okay. Uh, we need to make sure we have at least a thousand caps to buy the, you know, the fast travel thing once we get to Rivet City. All right. Stay safe. You do, you do too, and, you know, don't run right into super mutants. It's not good for your health. Okay. I want to see if we can rescue this poor woman up here that's being held captive. I wonder if we could snipe the muty from up here. I'm sure at some point we'll be going in there. Okay, where's he at? He's up by that bonfire up there. Man, those trees are kind of right in the way, aren't they? Okay, he's appears to be standing on the other side of his victim. All right, we were going to try and climb up there and see if we could get him from the other side, and then we had all this action happen. Oh, are you not going to let me up there? Damn it, Jim. I was hoping to get up on that ledge. Could try and take that shot, maybe. Hmm. Gonna have to just keep crippling him. Because I can't get a good headshot off on him. <laughs> Got him. Alright, I think that detected means the lady. Well, shit, that was kind of a waste of ammo, but... It's just the angle of everything. Did we already loot you? Uh, I'll take that. I don't think I'm going to take the mole rat meat. Yeah, I know you are. I'll be right there. Just hang ten. You're safe now. I'm just looking around. Okay. <laughs> there you are. Oh. Squad. Oh, we have a limb issue. So what if you guys were asking me if you could put a stim pack on a messed up limb? I've never done that because I've always just used... Ah, you can. Okay. I've always just used the, uh, you know, the splints for that. All right. Um... No, I don't want to put a doctor's bag on that. We've got to save those for our head. 
let's go uh, here and grab a splint and put it on the arm. Okay. It's about as good as it's going to get. We'll take that. Make sure there's no frags down here. Flying congressional style. Easy lockbox. Five millimeter rounds. We'll keep, let you guys keep the mutilated arm. But we will take the ammo and the caps and all that stuff. Makeshift bedding. Working on it. Eight missiles. Wow. That's quite valuable. And four more missiles. Okay, we'll take that. I think I'll take all this Please, raider armor and stuff because we're so... Ne oh. Can I get past that without getting burned? I guess so. Please. Someone. Untire. Didn't I already save you earlier? I'm... I'm alive. <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm... Here, I managed to hide this stuff before they tied me up. You take it. It's the best I can do to thank you. Okay. Um, I'm just curious... See, if I, if I do this option, it gives me karma. And the thing about karma is... I mean, obviously, we want good karma because of ideology in particular. And that's just how my character is. Um, but it also allows me to bank it. So that way, when I do occasionally do something naughty, <laughs> like steal, you know, we don't lose it. So the other thing I've noticed too, about these little encounters here is there's always pretty decent stuff just around the area to loot. So it's worth it to come here. So yeah, let's just, um, let her keep her stuff. Cause she probably needs it more than we do. You'd know best. Wouldn't you? I have to go again. Thank you. Yeah, again, this is the second time I've rescued you, lady, so maybe, hopefully I don't have to see you again. Go be safe and live life with your family. Stay away from super mutants and their assault rifles. Well, actually, maybe you could use an assault rifle. Okay. Very good. Let's see if we can get to Rivet City. Okay. You tired of taking it slow? I'm gonna... I'm going to do this because we have the money and I'm going to do it. So here we go. You have gained the premium travel DC pack perk. Thank you for purchasing the premium travel membership. Wastelander. Okay. So now we can... Wait a second. Why are you still charging me? I just gave you a thousand caps. I thought they gave us a free pass for the rest of our life. Obviously, it doesn't. Does it just give us like a massive discount? All right. I'm, I'm going to actually reload for my last save and try this again because I'm confused. Okay. So if we just do travel. Oh, okay. So... Why is it only giving us two options? I mean, we've passed this guy a million times at Megaton. I don't know. You, Tampany Tower, Megaton, Rivet City, Paradise Falls, Canterbury Commons. We will take you where you need to go. You want to change the wasteland? With every premium trouble membership purchased, we will donate 10% of the caps to a non-profit organization. <laughs> so I'm guessing the thousand caps just opens up all of the locations? Please do not attempt 
to engage this tired of getting mugged by raiders. Eat. I'd almost rather no further. The see if we can find one of the mole holes. What the hell? Brain fungus? Okay. What the hell is that? Uh, let's take a look at this metro station and see what it is. And uh, and Acostia. Yes. All right. Well, I guess paying the thousand caps is just opens up either all or at least some of the other locations. Where do you want to go? You want. See, that opens up Great H, Megaton, Fairfax Ruins, which I don't think we've been to yet, and Wilhelm's. Thank you for purchasing. All right. Uh, well, we're just going to go with that. Oh, right. We can use this, too. That's going to be handy. In fact, you know what we're going to do? Let's go ahead and ship our the chain gun now, because we know we're keeping that for sure. Or the minigun, and we'll also ship the Watts rifle. This is useful. <clears throat> um, I forgot to change back into the other armor again. Of course I did. Oh man, it can't take me anywhere. I think that's all that we want to do. Okay, so when we get to. Megaton, uh, those items will be there for us. Super useful. Please. Please. Please help me. I need water. I'm dying. Um, here, have some. You mean... You, you don't want anything for it? I don't have any caps or anything. Nah, you can have it. I can just have... It. I can just have it for free? Mm-hmm. Just report uh, this action to the Karma Gods. My... Thank you. Thank you so much. You've saved my life. Bless you. Okay. Cool. Hey, look at that. We've gained Karma. Yeah, yes. Oh. All right, wait a minute. How do we... How do we get over there? Okay, we have an intercom here. Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. You're just gonna... Oh, look at that. You're just gonna extend the bridge without asking me questions why I'm here or who I am? I guess so. Maybe that's what this guard over here is gonna do. Hold it right there. Dude, you could have let me get a little closer. Harkness. State your business in Rivet City. Um. Well, I am here to do research on the city's history. I am looking for my father. And I'm also trying to find a home for a little boy. But you're not giving me that option. So... Let's... I guess we'll choose the... Well, this one seems a little more legit because he could be saying, why do you want to know about our city's history so you can attack us? Yeah, let's go with this one. And who might your father be? If he lives on this boat, I know him. I'm sure you don't know him. He's lived in a vault his whole life. Why does it matter who he is? Yeah, let's, let's not be rude. Oh, yeah? And I'm a fairy princess. Okay, I can see why he might be skeptical of that answer, actually. You keep up this smart-ass attitude, and you're going to wind up floating face down in the river. Um, he's disappeared, and I'm just trying to find him. That's all. All right, all right. You can go on in. If I hear about any trouble, you're going to wind up in the river. 
You get me? I get you. Okay. Door to Rivet City Market, door to Stairwell. Well, let's go to the market. I'm looking for troublemakers. Oh. Have you seen any? Um I whenever I see troublemakers, I shoot them in the head. Okay. We are now at Rivet City. Look at us and our bad selves. Okay, so do we have access to this? We do. Nice. Oh, we can't we can't steal anything though. Uh what? Break down. No, I don't want to do any of that stuff. It's really dark here. Um okay, so we have there was some sort of battle in the city yesterday. The gate guard said the gunfire went on Shift's for over. an hour. Go get some rest. That... Me too. One of the new immigrants died of radiation poisoning last week. Oh, and I crashed.